it's a long road From Amistad to Toho Doesn't matter which way you go The miles are all the same But when you finally get there And when you pull the cover off Then it's time to get a little bit lost Out on the land Gonna back this boat into the water Find a way to win a couple dollars Where the man says there's a cold front coming down Bring it on, I've seen it all by now I can catch them shallow, I can catch them deep Open water or the back of the creek The wind and rain to me, it's all the same I make a living playing this game And I thank the Lord above every time I can I get to be a fisherman Thursday morning I'll have me something figured out It's not definite But just about Dude, I can make the cut And I'm betting on Sunday And I'll be fishing solo Just me and my cameraman Joe And with a little bit of luck I'll have just enough Gonna back this boat into the water Find a way What is going on? Good morning. I want to make this brief. I know everybody's got work to do. And uh, one thing we want to do is just get right into it. Uh, why did we go with fishing chaos? And you say, what in the world? Why? Well, here's the deal. Um, first of all, uh, we, we want to be as transparent as possible. Okay. We don't try to hide anything about what's going on. Um, and, and I want to show you some things that was brought to my attention and I expressed a ton of concerns. They actually called me up. They called me up and they talked about their system and try to bring me over. And I was very reluctant, hard headed, stubborn, reluctant because I've used the app and I was not a big fan of the app. And I, I had a very candid conversation with the guys over there and, they asked me, what is it going to take for you to, 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 to bring, bring your business over? And I said, look, I need a bracket scoring system. I need it. Um, you know, I've been asking for it, and I have yet to get it. Um, and so I, I, that would be a huge help. Also, my concerns were the leaderboard, um, having to scroll through everybody else's fish to see the leaderboard. And I also had some issues with you know, various things here and there. Within 24 hours... I got, without me asking, I got a bracket scoring system. They made a new update, and they fixed everything I had asked. I was blown away, and I'm going to show you why. And if you just give me a second and just be patient with me, I think we could win you over. And they won me over, and um, I was really, really impressed. But first, let me add Mr. Marcus to the phone. Oh, no. Marcus, um, you know, just trying to be transparent with these guys. You, you know, me and you are not fans of this um, in, in the very get go, man. Um, and I had to convince you as well and show you what I saw. What was your initial reaction? Man, so when we first started talking about it, I was the first person that was like, I, I don't. I don't like judging on it. I don't want to do it. Let's, let's, I'd rather make our own if we're going to go that route. And then, uh, I mean, 
And that was like what, Monday, Tuesday, somewhere in there. Monday. Mm-hmm. I think it was Monday. And uh, we talked last night, and you showed me what they did between Monday and yesterday. And I was like, sold. I got yeah. zero arguments, zero complaints. I've got, there's no reason why I can't back behind this. Right. So here, here's the deal. Um, here's what they did. Um, here's what they did. Um, and I'm going to show you. This was also a money issue as well. We wanted as much money to go back to the pot as much as possible to the anglers. The amount of money that we were spending with Tourney X it was taking a lot away from the pot. I mean, you, you, you think about it. It's taking about $320 per event out of the anglers' pockets to pay for the tournament management system. A lot of our anglers have already become subscribers through KBF through this, which saves you know the pot. So it allows us to do a lot more things with the anglers in terms of trophies and everything else uh, that we can give money right back to the angler. That was a huge decision because I want to show you this real quick. Um, here is here is fishing chaos, and this is the back end that that we have. Okay, as you can see, sees the register and all that good stuff. But guys, here's what's so different about it. These are the brackets this group round one is, is it's going to say greg nozar versus marcus Coates. And it's going to have each and every score you will also be able to see a full leaderboard by clicking full leaderboard and you will not have to scroll through everybody's fish to see it it will say rank them one through 64 but what this is doing is breaking up your specific matchup to yourself and you're going to be able to see this and you're going to be able to share this um you know just like you can with tourney x but it's going to show just like this eventually they are going to design it to where the actual bracket is going to be uploaded into the system and you'll actually see this live scored in a bracket but this will break out for you guys um you know your your individual matchups and so uh, oh, but Adam is not switching for the NC. No, no, this is not starting until after um, a- after the, the, Ju- the June 1st national qualifier. We're leaving the NC alone. But um, this is why we did it. So it, it, it highlights your individual matchups. I also want to show you something, guys. When you look at your um, app, make sure you update your app because all the uh, additional concerns that we had, has already been updated. So make sure that you guys are using 1.6.7 and how you do that, just go to your about um, tab right here in your Fishing Chaos app and make sure that you have this newest, latest and greatest version. They just came up with it maybe last week. Um, They just updated it and all those um, issues that we had uh, regarding decimal points, the leaderboards, all that stuff has been corrected. It's been done. Here's the here's the, here's what I found out. KBF has its own configuration. Um, they have a configuration set to what they want. I was shown um, on a on a sample to where we took different names um, from um, this app, and you know, or, or shown different ways to configure. But they left it alone and defaulted uh, a tr- straight up leaderboard like you see. On Tourney X, it's got 1 through 64 and all the names and all that good stuff. So it's straight, it's clean, it's perfect. But what I love about it, it does highlight your your group. So that's why we did it. And again, it's cost effective. Um, and, you know, look, I mean, I, I've used it at Lake Anna last week. I had zero issue. And I, I trust me, I'm the first to complain uh, when it comes to tournament management systems. I could not complain. I mean, I had zero issues with the NVKBA event. So anyway, um, that's why we did it. We're going to give it a shot, and uh, I, th- I think it's going to work. Please let me know your feedback while using it. Um, honestly, I was super impressed with the, um, you know, how, how they decided, you know, just they, they just did it. I mean, I didn't ask them to do it. They just did it, and within 24 hours, I got this, and I was just blown away. So anyway, that, that means a lot. Service is everything to me. So um, anyway, that, 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 that's in a nutshell. Um, Craig, will it show who's entered? Yes, it, it's going to show that. Um, we just literally put it up, so it's going to show it. It showed it there. So anyway, um, that's it, guys. I mean, that's it in a nutshell. That's, how, that's why we're doing it, and that's the whole reason. So I know we all have our own little um, – um, we have our own little um, nuances, and, and we're, we're basically – 
bred to, to have, you know, pick, pick and choose between the two, but we're going to try it. And if it doesn't work, we'll, we'll go somewhere, we'll go somewhere else. But for right now, we're going to try this and um, it is what it is. So anyway, Marcus, what do you think? Man, I think it's, uh, you know, based on the situations that we're, uh, that we're put in, it's a good move. I'm excited about it, excited to try it, excited to judge on it. You know, it's, uh, you, you know, the fishing community is evolving, and this is something we want to do, especially for the bracket tournament and being able to showcase individual matchups. I mean, all the math that we normally have to do on broadcasting, it's all done manual. Uh, this yeah. is something we've been looking forward to for two years, or, or, well, this is the second year, but for a solid year, we've been looking for something in this <clears throat> format. And, yeah. uh, all, you know, at this hey, point, it's only going to be better. Also, too, the winners automatically get put into the bracket. It just it takes the winners of that group and puts them into the new bracket. I'm going to answer some questions here real quick. Um, you said the back end. Uh, uh, Jeremy says, you, can you see the back end? No, I mean, we, we can see the back end. You guys can't. The front end is fixed. Um, Kurt, is it going to look better for people watching at home? Yes, it is. That new updated version has a much better uh, layout of what it looks like at home. That was one of the updates that they had. This goes into effect into the June bracket, John, not this one. This is not having anything to do with the national championship. This is the June bracket. So nothing's being effects, affected. So um, anyway, hope that answers a lot of your questions. Again, um, I, I want to go back to Kurt's question. A lot of that is configuration on the the tournament side and their side on how KBF configures their, uh, their way. Um, that was a major issue I had. So I'm telling you guys, I don't want to speak. I'm not speaking for KBF. I'm telling you, I was very reluctant and you guys might may or may not believe me, but I'm telling you straight up. I was extremely vocal about the concerns and they addressed them all with me. And I was super impressed and I have to give my hats off to them. So, Absolutely. Yep. Yep. So we're going to give a shot. And again, I mean, it just, it, it formats, it formats way better for us at this point. And again, it, the big decision for us too was cost effectiveness. A lot of y'all are already members because you guys fish with KBF. And, you know, if we can get half of our members already uh, signed up with fishing chaos, man, it just adds that more money to the pot. You know what I mean? It's huge. Huge. Yep. Ken Wood says fishing chaos is awesome. It is. It can. I mean, I didn't have, I didn't have an issue with it, man. I really didn't. I, I agree. Um, you know, this weekend, and they enhanced it for us um, even more so. So I have zero complaints at this point. I had a lot of complaints in, in the original uh, app, but again, make sure, guys. I can't express it again. Make sure that you go back and you update your app, and make sure it says one point six one point seven. And um, that is that is the way to go. So, guys, I don't want to spend too much more time at this. Um, but anyway, I, I want to kind of bring that to your attention, y'all. Um, anyway, we are transparent. We're 100 percent transparent. And, um, you know, we want to make sure that you guys understand this is not affecting any current tournaments that's going on. It will start in June with the new bracket that just came out. So go sign up uh, for that new bracket. I think you'll enjoy it. It's $50 to sign up. Um, go become a member at uh, BassBracket.com. Um, I think we already have like 16 people already signed up. I mean, I just literally released it here just a few minutes ago. Um, so anyway, I'm very happy with that response, but let's get 64 done and let's get it done quick and come to find out. We are also going to be opening up the team tournament bracket May 23rd. I think it's going to start. Hey, um, that's the, that's the team relay, the team's um, brackets in July. Okay. Team relay. That's just an yep. exhibition. The team's bracket. Sorry about that. It's going to be in July. So, uh, that's right. That's a four man team relay. That's a lot of fun. Uh, it's a one day event on May 23rd. Um, we're going to get that open as well. So and that's really, really fun. So anyway, we will get that all that taken care of as well. So, all right, guys, thank you guys for your time. Appreciate it. A lot of people on this morning, we wanted to be transparent and let you know that's what's going on. Y'all have a great day. If you have any questions, message me, call me, whatever you want to do, and I'll be happy to answer your questions. Take care.